Barry in the P.I. Barry and Maeta moved from the U.S. to the Philippines a little over a year ago from Texas. And the channel Barry in the P.I., it's mostly Barry's experience there. So Barry's a U.S. Navy vet who just celebrated his 79th birthday. Happy birthday. That was, that was a few months ago. <laughs> He's absolutely full of fun and interesting stories and tales from yesteryear. But his experiences in the Philippine Islands have been my favorites by far. And he is He's such a character, you guys. Trying to make sure that he dies from old age and not boredom. He spends um, a lot of time finding interesting and fun things that um, people up in years can still do in the Philippines. Barry's got the goods on the liquor also. In fact, his wife owns the liquor store. And when you live near a volcano and fight typhoons all the time, a strong drink might take you a long way. <laughs> Barry's a retired stand-up comedian... A park ranger. Hey, remember Misty of Chincoteague Island? Barry probably knew her personally. <laughs> I'm telling you, you'll not regret getting to know Barry in the P.I. Black Ribbon Stitch Studio. Denise loves crocheting and cross-stitching. For the unlearned among you, to cross-stitch is to do two exercises in one move. <laughs> no. <laughs> That's cross fit. Cross stitch involves needles and embroidery thread and a great attention to detail. And Black Ribbon Stitch Studio is all about detail. You just like watch how she made that old timey telephone. Y'all remember those? Denise loves to share her designs and her works in progress to encourage and inspire others who love yarn work as much as she does. If you work with yarn, you know there's the cheap stuff that's good, the good stuff that's cheap, and then the cheap stuff that's cheap. Well, Denise does yarn reviews, so that can help take the guesswork out of an armful of yarn. Speaking of armfuls, Black Ribbon Stitch Studio does needlework related shopping hauls. She does uh, crochet and cross stitch related YouTube tags and challenges also and even a few giveaways. So if you're even remotely curious about crocheting and cross stitching kind of crafts, pay a visit to Black Ribbon Stitch Studio. Vineyard Chicks. If you've never experienced the Vineyard Chicks, prepare to be wild. They all have their particular creator niche, and you can see how they all use their individual giftings on their Franken channel, Vineyard Chicks, and especially, though, on their individual channels. KK is the musical goat lover. <laughs> that sounds like the goats play the music, don't it? <laughs> Joyful Noises and Notes is getting filled with her cover songs. They're mainly praise and worship and the many instruments that she plays. Trey Designs is... Tree artsy fartsy nerdy techie channel. <laughs> She's really talented with her graphic design techniques and she can get into the little nuts and bolts of a video editing or, or some other kind of YouTube creator head scratcher and she gives really good advice on them. Bunky's channel is Bunky's Garden and she's in the garden, in the kitchen, and in the Bible. Bunky is getting into hydroponics, and she's already announced her candidacy for President of the United States. <laughs> okay, okay, shed wars, but it's still pretty big. So when KK, Trey, and Bunky get on their Vineyard Chicks channel, that's when what they each bring to the table becomes a homestead smorgasbord. They cover every topic imaginable for, like, a self-sustainable life organic pest control, how to make a disgusting lemon rind syrup, vertical and raised bed gardening, and there's no cutting corners. Well, maybe a little. But there's tons of DIYs that Vineyard Chicks are showing us that they use on the homestead all the time. Yep, the Vineyard Chicks are even emu approved. Oops, maybe not. So if you want to crack into the self-sustained lifestyle, Vineyard Chicks may be your channel. Fun in the sun in the P.I. with his hun. <laughs> Telling yarns and keeping us in stitches. Three musically inclining, graphic designing, horticultining. <laughs> Is that a word? <laughs> that sounds good though, right? <laughs> yeah. Are these your people? <laughs>